Hello friends, welcome to my channel, or back to my channel as the case may be. We are on day number 45 of our 1001 Tarot readings. Today's reading is called the Four Corners Spread. It's for when you need a little advice before going on a long, possibly uh, world-spanning trip. It is a four card reading and we will be using the Heaven and Earth Tarot for it. Let's get into it. For this reading, we will be using the Major Arcana and the Court cards. The first card is, am I ready for this? Am I, have I done all the preparation work spiritually, physically, financially to go on a trip of this magnitude? Card number two, should I go by myself or should I try to find someone to go with? Card number three, am I just going to be traveling or do I need to earn money as I go? Card number four, what should I absolutely not miss on this trip? So we're going to shuffle these court cards and the major arcana together and we will see what the cards have to tell us. You know, I realize I keep not shuffling actually on the second camera. I should probably do that. Still figuring out how to get everything set up now that I'm using multiple cameras and lights and things. All right, so card one, card two, card three, and card four. All right, card number one, am I ready for this trip? We have the sun reversed. So the sun is masculine energy. It is vigor. It is the driving force that brings about change. Being reversed, don't think you're quite ready yet. There's still something, something needing to be done to feel fully confident in this trip. Card number two, should you bring a companion? Uh, we have temperance reversed. That seems like a no to me. <laughs> Temperance is balance. It is confidence that things are going well. Being reversed, I'm inclined to think you're supposed to go by yourself on this trip when you're ready for it. Card number three, do you need to earn money on the journey as you go? Uh, is the chariot. Chariot is swift changes. It is inevitable change. With this spread, I'm inclined to believe that it will become necessary to do something to earn money, but that it's not, it's going to be something unexpected. You will have opportunities, not necessarily that you have to do it. Card number four is the Knight of Wands. So this is what you absolutely should not miss on your trip. Knights are young masculine energy. They are often lovers. They are, even, even if not lovers, they are the, the people we're interested in. Being of the suit of wands, which is fire, passion, intellect, Keep your eye out for someone who's intellectually stimulating. Someone who you might have a spark with on this trip. You will have many opportunities as you travel that are going to open doors. And we never know what might happen if we don't try. If we don't leave ourselves open to the possibility. That is the Four Corners spread. Or am I ready? How should I prepare for a long journey? I hope you enjoyed it. If you agree with my uh, analysis of these cards or disagree, let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. And if you really enjoyed it, go ahead and subscribe so you'll be notified when I put up more videos. Until next time, walk in the light, my friends. Bye.